SP Column provides a powerful and flexible module called SP Section, which can be used to create any type of irregular section. The SP Section module is accessed by clicking the Irregular Section icon in SP Column. Within SP Section, we have many ways to create different shapes and bar arrangements which may be combined into a single section. Let's begin by drawing a rectangle. Click the Rectangle tool and click on the workspace to begin drawing. Drag your mouse and click to finish. Let's draw another rectangle. Click to start, but this time enter in its dimensions pressing enter after each. We want 80 inches for the width and 20 inches for the height. Let's rotate the new rectangle. Choose the Select tool and select your rectangle. Pick the Rotate icon. Move your cursor close to the corner and watch how SP Section snaps to the corner to help you select your rotation base point. Now click to select the point and move your cursor to rotate the rectangle and click to finish. Now snap to the corner of our rectangle and drag it to the other rectangle and click to finish. Let's add a circle. Select the arrow next to the circle icon and select the circle two point option. Now snap to the corner of our rectangle and click to start and click to finish. We combine these shapes into our final shape by using the combine tool. We can draw arbitrary shapes another way by using the polygon tool. Click to start drawing and continuously click on the workspace and right click to finish. Next let's create a shape with an opening in it. Select the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle. Now choose the opening option and draw an opening inside our rectangle. Click to start and click to finish. Now we have a box with a hole in it. To make an opening on the wall, draw another opening, choose the select tool, select our opening, and snap to it the middle of its side. Then drag it to the middle of our shape. Click to finish. Click the combine tool to see our final shape. Finally, let's add some reinforcement. To have a closer look, select the zoom to window tool and drag a window around our polygon. Now turn off the grid, turn the cover on, choose the linear bar pattern tool, and change the cover to 2.5 inches. Snap to one of the corners and click to select your starting point. Then click on the next corner to draw the bars. We can change the bar spacing from 3 to 6 inches. And we can click corner to corner to finish drawing our bars. Let's do that again, but this time with clear cover. Select undo to undo the bars, choose the clear cover option, and watch how SP section snaps to an internal point to provide the specified clear cover for the bars. Click to start drawing your bars and click corner to corner to complete your bars. Finally, let's zoom out. Using the select tool, while holding down control, we can select multiple shapes and delete them. And now we can save and exit to send our section to SP column.